Special closing. Um, this closing is something that I think uh, it came up just uh, the last half a day. I was thinking about what should I talk about uh, in closing. I thought maybe let's take a walk down to a memory memory lane of agile community in Singapore to see uh, the journey that we have come so far. So uh, it started all from my perspective of what I can recall. Uh, it started in year 2008. So in year 2008, there's no formal agile meetups. There's, there's only like, a, hey, would you like to, uh, we have a Yahoo mailing list, and uh, Buzz would, would ask, oh, uh, would you like to come and uh, have a dinner, and let, let's chat about it. So um, it's a very informal dinner, like a few people would turn up. Um, if you can recognize on the left is uh, Craig Laman, Last. And you no, know, oh, this is very irregular. Until year 2010, Adrian Kaminsky, um, I believe he is here. Yeah. So um, he started he started the Meetup Agile Singapore group in Meetup.com, and uh, we have the first a formal Meetup. There are about about 20 people turned up. I still can remember that time. So um, it's, it's still pretty in informal. People just discuss about what they have been through. And then as, as that went by, I also started to you know, organize some coding dojos. And sometimes uh, I got to hear famous people, or rather book authors uh, coming by Singapore, like uh, Lasse, uh, who wrote uh, test-driven and effective unit testing. We will invite them to give a talk to the community. So uh, one fine day before, uh, in year 2011, we, we heard the news from the organizers of Software Freedom Day that says, hey, uh, Agile Singapore, would you like to come and do an exhibit uh, in the National Library in Singapore? I thought, no, no why not? Uh, let's try. So I asked for volunteers, and we have some volunteers that are trying to introduce you know, what is Agile about. And we also played a ballpoint game. For those who have attended the Agile Review on Monday, uh, this is when uh, uh, it started. So in year 2012, um, I received a message from, from Jeffrey Federick and Paul Julius, who are the organizers of Continuous Integration and Testing Conference, says that, hey, how about let's, uh, would you like to organize a small conference in Singapore? I thought, well, why not? And it seems to be pretty simple. So at that time, Bank of America was the, was the venue host, and um, and we started to have the first kind of a small Agile conference in Singapore. Um, that conference is led by Open Space. So that is the first time I get exposed to Open Space in a formal way. And, and of course, uh, we have volunteers from the community as well uh, that organizes this. So Open Space uh, inspired me to, you know, maybe in our regular meetups, we should do that. So we tried. Year 2012, after the KitCon, they call it KitCon um, conference, we started to use open space formats in our meetups. So this is the first uh, photo I can find from that time. Uh, we do it in the evening, only three slots and three spaces in my very small office. Uh, sometimes we get a lot of people, uh, and it's very hot because we are air condition isn't very well. But it's also at that time we thought, you no, know, the community, uh, the membership in the meetup.com has went up to about, I couldn't recall, probably a thousand people, members. So we thought, no, maybe we should try to have a kind of a more formal conference in Singapore. Uh, I, w I attended the Agile conference in the US for the past, uh, from year 2010. So I kind of have an idea, maybe we should have that kind of conference here. And, and then we, um, we made it. The first Agile conference in Singapore. <laughs> in, in the help of volunteers. So how do we get volunteers in open space meetup? We just post a set a topic. Or who wants to volunteer to the to organize the conference? And some hands are good uh, hands raised. Uh, Edward is one of them, Slide is one of them, and they, they were the organizers at that time for the year 2013 and 14 conference. So we are invited like Kent's back, and 
uh, David Hussman and a few other people to the conference, to that first conference. So even after the conference, we still continue to do uh, open space meetups regularly every month. At that time, you no, know, I'm kind of like stretch, doing leading all the organizing work. I thought maybe I should start to grow facilitators. Uh, with open space meetups, it is easy to help to grow open space facilitators. And Farid was one of them. That is also one of the reasons. It's one of the early open space facilitators that, that uh, we work together and we grow together. Uh, that is also one of the reasons why I invited him to be the MC. So over the time, uh, in 2013 and 14, we have a group of facilitators that would, would jump in and help out to facilitate and organize. We also have a lot of value sponsors like Barclays, Idea Labs, uh, help a lot in those years. In year 2014, we, we asked ourselves, should we still do another Agile conference? Then we thought, yeah, we still have some energy left. <laughs> so, so let's do it. So this time, uh, uh, the first conference was two days. The second conference in 2014 is three days. We thought, oh, we should have more topics and, 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 and people. Uh, and we did it again in Marina Bay Sands. Uh, we, we were very pleased to invite. We, we got Linda Rising and Dave Snowden and Richard Sheridan, uh, Steve Freeman and many others. So it was a great conference. Um, and it was three days. It was you know, over, over exhausting for us. So after the conference, we decided to, uh, let's, uh, let's not do it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> so we break out, and then what happened next is that over in year 2015, people have been telling me that, oh, Sammy, uh, do you have a conference in 2015? I said, oh, no, we are out of energy. <laughs> so, but there's a lot of encouragement from companies, different companies and people. And I thought, no, maybe we, we, we should do one more. <laughs> one last one. <laughs> um, that wouldn't happen if Naresh J. Where's you, Naresh Jane? Where are you? Yes, yes, at the back. He said, no, Stanley, it's a waste if you stop. What, what can I do to help you? I think. Uh, so, the 13 and 14 conference, uh, I have my, my colleague, uh, Stuart Turner, who helped a lot in getting the speakers. And, and, and you know, having two person from the same company to organize volunteer for this conference is very, is very costly. So, so you should drop out. And, and then I, I've run of ideas until the rest of said that you know, I can help with the speakers. I thought, no, oh, why not? So both of us in the early uh, 2016, we tried to get the speakers ready. And, and so, you know, over time, uh, so apart from that, in the early, this year, I decided to uh, really hand over the whole regular meetups um, group to, to a group of organizers. And, and, and then they have been running, running it since, uh, since the early of the year. So that I can focus on the conference. Um, you know, so the rest is history. Uh, the rest, Jane, I started with Latin speakers and gradually we grow the, the community team. Uh, we grew to a lot of people, more than here, and we have come a long way. And uh, I believe this will be the last one that I will, I will have a major contribution. Uh, no, I'm, I'm saying up here, it means uh, really the last one. <laughs> <laughs> oh, <help> <laughs> so I really want to um, appreciate, you know, this is not possible without incremental growth incremental responding to change. We have a plan, but the plan always change. Um, the volunteers uh, this time in this conference has been excellent. Uh, hotel staff is, well, I'd like to appreciate hotel staff as well. Let's give them a round of applause. <laughs> so let's invite all volunteers to come, to come on board. I'd like to acknowledge them. All volunteers, please come on board. This conference is impossible without time and effort, sacrifice from other, other from family, from other things, from work. Uh, come on, there's more, I believe.
Okay. Um, Naresh? Yes. Let's formally give them a round of applause. current group of meetup organizers. Can you please step forward? <laughs> they will be the ones that continue our job with us in Singapore. And, and we hope to, I hope to um, grow them and also provide opportunities so that you know, everyone and probably even more new people is able to learn how to organize events like this. Yeah, and that's about it. No, um, the next week, oh, the rest. Uh, I do want to thank Stanley for doing a tremendous job in putting this conference together. <laughs> I've seen him up at 3 in the morning, 4 in the morning, you know, really worried at one point that we wouldn't be able to pull off this conference, but he stood behind the conference and made it possible, so big round of applause for Stanley. We have come a long way. This is, you know, I would like you to be part of the milestone, to be part of the milestone in, in a, a group photo. Yeah, would that be a good idea? Yeah. Yes! Alright, so let's arrange for the group photo.